What is going on, Coaster Spotters? It is November 1st, and we are back at Hershey Park for construction update number two of Candemonium and Chocolate Town. First, first, starting off here at the storage lot. Thank you to one of my Twitter followers for letting me know where this is. So, let's go ahead and see the rest of the track back there. See plenty of track. I don't believe this is it though. This is definitely not everything. It may seem like a lot, but it definitely is not the entire ride. I'd be shocked that there's not more deliveries coming. Know the scale of how big this BM track is, just take a look at that car right there next to it. That is the SUV. Alright, let's head on over to Chocolate World and check out the front gate area. Alright. Here we can see the carousel building going up. So even more buildings all making up the whole new complex all around us. And this new park entrance is just absolutely massive. What he's doing most likely is he's marking individual bolts that have been torqued specification. So this whole helix is definitely a lot better than I was expecting. To be. It looks a lot of fun. Uh, very similar kind of nitros actually. Very tight. 
which would be fantastic. And that drop off of the Helix. Ooh, now that looks awesome. Reminds me a lot of Fury's Trouble Clef. That should be, it might be the highlight of the entire ride. Once again, here is the area where the fountain and the final helix will be. Looks, looks a lot of fun. It's gonna dive into the helix and then rise out of it, which looks uh, really fun. Uh, something different than most VMs, to be honest. So, just to let you know, between these two buildings right here that has unfinished face right now, and the one that has the brick wall halfway up, that is where the front gate is actually gonna be. That's where the roof is gonna span. So, I assume once Chris, Christmas Candy Lane ends, uh, our access will be cut off a little bit. That twist out of the helix and into that twisted drop, just gonna be fantastic. I cannot wait for that. Still not happy about that trim break. Hopefully it'll be the only one. This actually gives you a good scope of scale of how big B&M's actually are, their track. Next to the dudes working and building this thing for us. Absolutely massive staging area for all this uh, construction of Chocolate Town. Fahrenheit is getting a nice paint job to make it look all fresh and new. The left is the new, the right is the old. Alright, so we are back by the new road. And you can see how far the footers actually go. That drop looks fantastic from multiple angles. So here we can see all the footers for the rest of the ride. Pretty much in a straight line for turnaround at the end. Looks like most of them are pretty much ready.
another freshly painted coaster is Great Bear. So that is going to do it for update number two here at Hershey Park of Candemonium and Chocolate Town. Thank you so much for watching. We should be back in at least two weeks, maybe a week, for another update. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. This has been Alex. See you next time.